One in five children between the ages of three and 17 has a diagnosable mental, emotional, or behavioral health disorder. At Johns Hopkins All Children's Hospital, we are training the next generation of leaders in pediatric behavioral health to help those children. There are challenges that youth today face that might not have been there previously. This is a time where I believe our trainees, our psychologists, our mental health experts can really step in and support our children to make sure that they are able to achieve to their potential. Founded in 1926, Johns Hopkins All Children's is a 259-bed teaching hospital in St. Petersburg, Florida. In 2011, we became the first hospital outside the Baltimore, Washington region to join the Johns Hopkins Health System. Our Center for Behavioral Health is located in the Child Development and Rehabilitation Center, but is integrated throughout our inpatient and outpatient care. The Center for Behavioral Health strives to provide the highest level of quality, evidence-based care to children and adolescents, not only in the Tampa Bay region, but across the state of Florida. The people I trust, so yeah. I don't really trust anyone else. No. Johns Hopkins All Children's Hospital offers a robust behavioral health training program with general pediatric psychology internships and one and two year postdoctoral fellowships devoted to pediatric psychology, neuropsychology, and autism and developmental disabilities. We emphasize clinical treatment, research, education, and diversity inclusion in all of our training programs. So our psychology fellowship program aims to train leaders in the field. We specialize in training in pediatric psychology and autism and developmental disabilities. My fellowship here really helped me meet my uh, career goals of becoming a pediatric psychologist and specializing in eating disorders because I gained really wonderful broad skills um, where I feel comfortable working with all different uh, medical diagnoses and different psychological diagnoses while also getting a specialized experience um, working in eating disorders. The Johns Hopkins All Children's Neuropsychology Fellowship Program has been an APPCN member program since 2016 and the fellowship position involves both clinical care and didactics and trainings as well as supervision mentorship. But what's unique about our program is that our fellows have the opportunity to do program development as well. I think the moment I really knew that this was the place for me uh, was during a conversation with my fellow interns last year. We all talked about how the interview process is really long, it's really grueling, and we were worn out by the time we got to this interview. But this is the first place that we all really felt energized, uh, we felt reinvigorated, and we knew that this is the type of environment that we could be most successful in. A fellowship or internship at Johns Hopkins All Children's brings the opportunity to interact with top clinical experts in medically complex patients, ranging from premature infants to children receiving cutting-edge blood and bone marrow transplants. When you're at a children's hospital, it isn't only the child that is presenting to you, but it's the family as a whole who has been through a complex medical diagnosis, potentially, or surgery, or has a complex set of concerns. And really, our work is not only treating the child and family, but also working with the medical team. And one of the amazing things about being here is this incredible group of medical professionals that we have is able to give our children life and ensure that they are as healthy as possible. And as behavioral health professionals, it's our responsibility to ensure they have the highest quality of life as well. The really exciting part is that they not only serve on multidisciplinary teams, but they become very interactive in those teams. And the value of psychology or neuropsychology becomes apparent in their work with everyone from the attending level, uh, physicians, all the way to support staff. Um, nursing, that includes all of our um, multidisciplinary therapies, audiologists, so no matter where you're working, you you really do feel connected with the hospital at large through each and every patient care opportunity. 
my goal when I'm working with families and patients is to really understand what are their current needs and how can we help. And so when families come to us, they're coming seeking answers, seeking treatment recommendations. And so with a real empathetic and compassionate approach, we want to help answer the questions that they're seeking and then give recommendations that are the best recommendations that we know based on the current research, the current information that we have to help their child reach their full potential and be as successful as they can be. One of uh, my most fulfilling days as a trainee here was working with a family who is just really struggling to figure out um, how to work with their child. You can feel, you can tell that they're overwhelmed, they were stressed at the beginning of the appointment and as we got to feedback and walk through recommendations you could just see the tension kind of lift from the family and they felt like they really had some answers to move forward with their child. Our programs prioritize wellness and balance for our team and trainees. These efforts are supported by the vibrant and diverse Tampa Bay community. Whether your passions are beaches, sports, arts, dining, or theme parks, our area offers plenty to meet your needs. The thing that makes Tampa Bay a fun place to live is there is literally something for everyone. So there is obviously the beaches, the sun is constantly shining. If you're an active person, there's places to bike, rollerblade, there's state parks, you can kayak. Uh, if you're someone who enjoys the arts, there's museums, there's art museums, there's murals all over St. Petersburg. There's a really active local culture. It's not just sunshine 300 days out of the year, but it's also the warmth of the people who reside here. It's a great mix of that city urban life but also the relaxed feel of a community and I do love our enriching arts and music and our museums so we have a great balance for work and life but I also love of course our sports life. If you want a challenging but collegial experience that offers strong interaction with faculty, applying for training at Johns Hopkins All Children's is the right choice for you. I really love my experience here and working here for, for many reasons, but really one of the, the things that comes to mind is the fact that I can work with other healthcare professionals that are wonderful on a a professional level but also on a personal level um, and that as a team we can provide really amazing care um, so that gets me excited every morning um, and I go home feeling good about the care we've we've given to these patients and these families and when we go through tough times with patients we have each other as colleagues to rely on and, and get us through that um, and so that camaraderie it makes an amazing difference and I think that really makes us a unique place and a, a wonderful place to work.